Hello YouTube, it's Ryan here with some terminal gameplay on the game Modern Warfare 3. So, today I start out really quickly here with 3 kills within a couple of seconds, and I'm gonna end up 30 and 8. It's not that good of a gameplay, but it will serve its purpose, considering it was my very first game on the Modern Warfare 3 version of Terminal. I went into the game and said, I'm just gonna win the game. So, I went in and won the game. Throughout this game, you're going to see some good places that you can sit and wait for people. It's not really camping because people can come at you from pretty much every angle. So, I would not consider this a campy gameplay. So, this guy really just spams with the Barrett. If you could hear audio, I don't have my settings really that well. But if you could have heard audio there, he literally spammed his Barrett there. But... Up here, if you go up the side of these, it's a really good way to get cover. Right here, I kind of fell off of it, though. But I'm going to go back up here and kill this guy. He's going to lay it down in the suitcases. But this is pretty much where I spend the rest of the game. And as you can see, I got off to a quick eight kills. And really, the closest competitor is going to be six or seven kills behind me at the end. So... Basically, what I did was just sit up there and just use my turtle beaches to hear where everyone was coming from. It's pretty much the best you can do. There are three main ways that they can come at you from there, which are from that hallway, from the area to the right by Burger Town, and from those stairs. And you're also going to want to watch up there where that ladder goes up, sort of where I just fell through that grenade. But I'm just going to sit here and do my best to commentate as this goes. I was going to say also that this isn't going to be the best quality video because I do not have an HD PVR. I only have the Dazzle and I don't really have very good software because everyone who has problems with the Dazzle has major problems with the Dazzle. It's not really with the Dazzle itself, it's with the Pinnacle Studio 14 that came with it. Like, it's just really shitty, to say the least. Ooh, sorry for hitting the mic there. But, it the importer on it doesn't work. So, I have to use a Movie Maker recording for this. I'm looking for a better software to use. If you guys know of a better software, you, you could tell me if that would be great. And I fell through another grenade. But once this game starts to get spread out, the kills start to get further and further apart. So it gets a little more boring. This guy was just like faking me out here. He goes into final stand. And then he... <laughs> that guy went into final stand on me so many times in this gameplay. But pretty much, this was not a hard lobby in the least. There was... At one time, a 20th prestige in it, but I think he may have rage quit somewhere along the road. You know, those 20th prestiges with their KD. But right now, I'm just pretty much utilizing my position to get kills. That's all you really can do on terminal is just stay in that little area and look down that hallway. In team-based games, that's pretty much the best strategy because you can get collaterals going down that hallway because people just run through that hallway with their teammates behind them. But back there, later on, there's some guys just having fun with a care package. This guy, he pulls out FMGs on me after I like parkour so... I wasn't too happy there. Let's see what happens now. Yeah, I'm just scanning around back there. I find the guys playing around with the IMS. And he kills him, and this guy runs on the screen. I'm just going to take this IMS from them for the XP and throw it down. So, pretty much so they don't have one. <laughs> and if they go back there thinking maybe the kid will be camping back there. They're just going to get killed. So Right now, I'm going to have a couple more kills and a few more deaths. 
towards the end of the game, I kind of slowed down. That tends to happen on long games. This turned into a long game compared to what I thought. This here's where this guy goes in the final stand again on me. But like I was saying, this game got really long. After I got those six kills in about like thirty seconds, forty seconds, I thought it was gonna be a pretty fast game. But it turned into a seven minute game, so it took a long time. But I'm glad that I found the good strategy. You guys can see what a good strategy on free for all is. So from what I saw in my playing on this, that's the absolute best strategy is to stay in that area because all the other areas like that one area where I started was good for a start when there's a lot of people there, but it's not a very high traffic area other than that. But Right here, I'm gonna see some guy. I may get killed again. Oh yeah, I remember that. It just hit there. It hit the window and dropped straight down. Got a hit marker. Yeah, I think I'm gonna die uh, one more time right here, and then I'm gonna finish out the game with these last two kills. So yeah, I get killed from the side right here, and then I'm gonna see a kid running towards the back of that plane, or from the back of that plane, behind the plane. And he's going to also be the same kid that I get the final kill on in a second here, while he's camping his balls off. Like, watch this. Alright, I get a hit marker. And he's sitting there with a blast shield, probably blast shield pro in that corner. And he just gets knifed. <laughs> Alright guys, so that was me going 30-8 and eight on the map Terminal after it came out on Modern Warfare 3 today. For those of you who didn't know, the map Terminal did come out for Modern Warfare 3 today, free to play for all Call of Duty players. Yesterday it was just for Call of Duty Elite players, but today it came out for everyone. So in this gameplay, it was not all Call of Duty Elite people. That's probably why I didn't lose, because Call of Duty Elite people are normally the people who actually do well. So, if you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a like and a favorite. It shows me that you want to see more of it. So, I will see you guys in later videos. Peace out.